Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Cary Grant's daughter says the Hollywood legend doesn't he flirt with men, but she wouldn't he have cared if he had Cary Grant's timeless good looks and extensive filmography have made him an enduring subject of fascination for Hollywood scholars and casual moviegoers alike. While his collaborations with the likes of Alfred Hitchcock and Howard Hawks remain among the most popular films in the American canon, his personal life continues to hold as much fascination as his work. Rumors of Grant's sexual relationships with other men including his co-star and roommate Randolph Scott, have circulated for years from sources of varying credibility. Grant was throughout his life married to five different women, but his sexuality remained a subject of speculation until his death in 1986. Questions about Grant's orientation are unlikely ever to be fully answered, as neither Grant nor his alleged sexual partners are still alive to speak about it. When you hang out with your parents a lot, you see them in a way that almost nobody else does. And I've never seen a hint of it, Grant said. I think I would have noticed, but I wouldn't have cared. Jennifer Grant made it clear that she wouldn't have had a problem with her father being gay or bisexual. But she just didn't see any evidence of it, other than his close one's friendship support the theory. But I have to tell the truth. Dad was charming and made great friends. But he wasn't he flirtatious with men, she said. A friend of mine recently sent me a picture of Gregory Peck, my father and Mervyn Leroy, and they are good friends. Her comments come at a time when certain movie aficionados have re-evaluated Hollywood's fascination with dead star sex lives. IndieWire's Christian Blavold recently lamented that the documentary Rock Hudson, All That Heaven Allowed, focuses on the late star's death from AIDS, while not delving deeper into his acting career. Happily, Hudson's films are still there to be discovered and enjoyed again, he wrote, watch them for what is there, not what you think, sign up for IndieWire's.